Hello Blender users and welcome to this video about the path action add-on. It's one of the first I've made and probably the one I use the most. So let's dive into it. Once the add-on is activated, you will see a little folder icon at the top right corner of the Blender interface. The tooltip indicates what it does. A single click will open up uh, the file browser of your operating system where the blend file is. A control click will copy the full file path to clipboard. A control shift click will copy the file path stopping at the parent folder. And the alt click will copy the file name to the clipboard. Shift click on the button will open a list of all the blends that are in the same folder. And this allows to have a quick overview of what's in there. And also just click and open up the blends. For example, here I open the V3 and I can reopen the V4. Just careful because it will not ask if the blend is saved before changing. Uh, alternatively, you can use the button here that will open the file in a new instance of Blender. Using the Blender file browser, you will see two new buttons. The open folder allows to open up the folder where you are currently are, and the blend location allows to jump back where the blend is saved currently. Once the preferences are expanded, you also have access to a set of buttons to open up some places of Blender, for example the config folder, if you want to back up your user preferences, or as well of the add-on places. Expanding this area, you can open up an add-on folder by clicking on the name, or just by searching using this button. Interesting for add-on developer, if you tick the developer mode, you will have another button up here, and when you click, it will ask if you want to fully reopen the file uh, in a new Blender instance, closing the previous one, so that way you have a full reload of everything. That's all about path action. As you can see, nothing super fancy, but uh, it's still the add-on I enabled first. So I hope it will be as useful for you as it is for me, and see you for the next one.